Allosaurus pretty much was not afraid of anything because it would be very difficult to kill this beast. This creature's armor protects something else as well, its eyes. The eyelids of an Ankylosaurus are made of bone. Yet a body covered in steel-tough armor is only the beginning. Ankylosaurus also has a powerful offensive weapon, its tail, a club that can pummel an opponent with 43,000 pounds of force. The top half is composed of muscle. The vertebrae on the lower half are fused together to form a solid rod-like whip. This tail can snap more than 45 degrees in either direction. At the very end is a bony mass, like a built-in sledgehammer. A giant mace that's really well built for smashing into the heads or the legs of Tyrannosaurus and its relatives. All told, this tail packs a punch powerful to shatter the leg bones of almost any predator no matter how big. An impact from that club could crush bone, shatter teeth, if not kill the T-Rex outright, wound it in such a way that it's likely to starve to death. Like a wrecking ball weighing almost 100 pounds, swinging at a speed of 48 miles per hour, it strikes a devastating blow. The tip is designed not to split on impact, it absorbs the stress of all that firepower. The hammer gives because it's not solid bone. Instead, it's honeycombed with soft tissue, marrow, blood, and fat. Ankylosaurus combines steel-like protective plates with a powerful offensive weapon. The result, a creature with few rivals over more than 100 million years of evolution. Ankylosaurus represents the end of the history of the armored dinosaurs, the ultimate in dinosaurian tanks. 